Have you ever had one of those years where you looked up and it was January and then just like that, in the blink of an eye, it was already September? Well, the year's not over just yet. So that's right, we've got 126 days left in the year. So join me as I map out the rest of my year in my vision board and we'll make the rest of the year unforgettable instead of waiting to a New Year's resolution. If you're ready, let's go ahead and dive right in. Sometimes life gets the best of us, but it's then that we need things to pick us right up. And a vision board is actually a pretty cool instrument to help keep our thoughts and our goals aligned. So I'm going to present to you my very own vision board for the rest of 2023, starting off with our YouTube channel. Here on Network Your Future, as of today, we're at 29 channel subscribers. And so I want to thank each and every one of you out there for supporting the channel. And if you're watching this video right now and you haven't subscribed, then why not go ahead and hit the subscribe button down below and bring us one step closer to reaching the channel goal. So hitting that thousand subscriber mark by the end of the year might seem too daunting for many, but for me, it's a challenge that I definitely want to take on and there's a lot of great content coming up. So you definitely want to click on that bell so that you can be alerted of each and every video that's on the way. I love throwing darts, but this dartboard here, that's really not what it's all about. This represents staying on target and hitting the mark. There's so many opportunities that present itself in life, and each of those brings with it their very own challenge. So I've been very blessed this year to have met some of the marks that I set for myself as it relates to personal certifications not only in Cisco, but also in the cloud in general, on the AWS and Azure side. So I really want to just finish the year off strong there and also to beef up my automation skills so that I can provide back to my organization and to the stakeholders and clients there. And that brings me to the very next thing. This icon here doesn't represent legends of the hitting temple. If you were born in the 80s, but raised in the 90s, you may remember that right there, but actually this is Python's official icon and Python actually helps a lot of network and security engineers just looking to sharpen my Python skills again so that I can help my organization as well as share some of those tips and tricks with you all. They say what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas, but this is actually one of those places that I used to frequent every year. But since COVID, I actually haven't been back. And I just want to actually get away and take a trip before the year's end. And there's actually one important milestone that I'm going to reach in life. And I'm going to share that with the channel when the time's right, but definitely before the year's over. So looking to travel a little bit more and get outside my comfort zone. Mentorship is a very big thing with me. And I truly believe that true mentorship isn't something that's paid for but it's actually given free by those in position to do so. Now, there's a lot of people out there that'll take advantage of this word, but I just want to build a community here where we can help each other out. And I'm going to find the perfect solution to build that community. And hopefully it takes flight here and some roots start bearing fruit here shortly. So just be on the lookout for that. Last but not least, Dr. King or Dr. Dre. You may wonder what the heck is this all about? Well, I actually started my doctoral pursuit back in 2018. And truth be told, I finished all of my classes to be considered a doctor all but dissertation. But during COVID, I made a lot of excuses and didn't really complete my dissertation. So I'm actually going to have to start that journey all over again. But really, this year is not about really starting that. It's just deciding on which university to attend and just putting things in my life in the proper place and perspective so that I can make sure that when the time's right next year, that I carve out that space to finish what I started. So again, these are just a few of my very own personal goals, not only for the channel here, but also for my personal life and hoping that I can reach each and every one of those goals. But regardless of the outcome, I'm truly going to give it my best and put my best foot forward. And I'm hoping that each and every one of you can take a testament to this and do the same. 
It may seem like 2023 is almost behind us, but we've got over 100 days to really put our foot down and and take advantage of the time. So I challenge each and every one of you to just pause. Take a moment to reflect on those things that early in the year that you thought that you wanted to do. And if you've already met those, then 100 percent kudos to you. But for many of us out there, there's small things that got in the way and Maybe we took a pause and I just want to challenge you to go ahead and pick that baton back up and see if you can finish some of those things before the year's out because 2024 is almost here and you know a lot of people make those New Year's resolutions, but why not go ahead and finish off some of those things here this year? And I'm going to try my best again to hold to some of those and number one on that list actually is the mentorship. So I really, really want to find a way to give back here in this community in a different way than other channels. So I'll carve out my own unique spot here and just hoping each and every one of you can support me as I make a little bit of changes here on the channel. But like I said, I appreciate each and every one of you out there for rocking in here with me today. And like I said, it means more than enough. Those 29 strong love each and every one of you wishing each and every one of you all the best today and beyond. So until next time, stay safe. Take care of yourselves. Peace.